Right now, hundreds of adjunct professors at Columbia College are on strike. And it comes after the college eliminated classes impacting students and part-time faculty across the college. CBS 2's Assault Rezai is live there this morning with more on their demands. Good morning, Assault. Good morning, Dana, Adrina. You can see the picket line uh, underway right now here behind me, and I'll step out of the way so you guys can see what exactly is going on here. We're at the corner of Michigan Avenue and Harrison. I can tell you about 75 to 100 people right now on this strike. Some of the signs read Columbia faculty on strike, unfair labor protests. Where's the money? Uh, some people holding up signs in protest of Dr. Kim, the leader of the school here. We know that 600 part-time adjunct professors, part of the Columbia College Faculty Union, are a part of this strike. The union criticizing the college's commitment to a quality education after they say they cut hundreds of already enrolled classes and merged other classes, which will ultimately lead to an increase in other class sizes. Union members calling the changes unfair, saying they're leading to a structural deficit that will heavily impact not only students, but part-time faculty. College officials say they are disappointed in the union's leadership for calling a strike and are hoping they can bargain in good faith regardless of a deficit for the greater needs of students. We talked to the president of the college just faculty union moments ago. Let's listen. These are classes that students want and need. We have the enrollment numbers. They just want to consolidate increased class size. They don't want to advertise it, even though students are coming for small class size. They increase the tuition, and they want to do it on the backs of the most marginalized faculty. At the same time, they're increasing their salaries. It's unconscionable. And we're told this morning the school says that classes and schedules will continue as usual. Also, any students that miss any classes because of the ongoing strike will not be held accountable. Still ahead this morning, there's a news conference planned for 1030. We'll be here live to bring you updates all morning long. I'm live in the South Loop. I'll reside CBS 2 News. Sal, thank you so much for that live report. We appreciate it.